What I want to do today is connect our Google Sheets and Katana app so that whenever a new spreadsheet row is filled out, a sales order will automatically be generated in Katana. Zapier is a no-code tool that makes it easier for anyone to automate workflows across 5,000 plus apps. If you don't have an account, there's a link in the description for a free two-week trial so you could try it risk-free. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap by clicking the button on the left-hand side of the screen. Because I want Sheets to trigger a sales order in Katana, I'll need to use Sheets as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click New Spreadsheet Row as my event and then click Continue. Setting this as the trigger means that anytime Sheets sees a new row is created, it's going to run this workflow. The first time we set up Sheets, we'll need to authenticate it with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Google Sheets account. Don't worry, it's totally safe because Zapier uses industry standards for encryption when connecting with each of your apps. I'll put a link to Zapier's security and trust page in the description as well. We'll then need to fill out our trigger apps data. To do that, select the spreadsheet and worksheet you'd like to use for your Zap and click continue. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. To do that, click test trigger. You're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our first action. Type in Katana into the search bar and select it on the drop down menu. Next, click Create Sales Order and click Continue. From there, I can select our account and authenticate Katana with Zapier, just like I did with my Google account. By the way, if at any point you get stuck, Zapier's got an amazing support team that can help you out. There's a link in the description to their forum post for this specific workflow. Click Continue and it's time to assign our Trigger Apps data into the Action Apps fields. First, select the customer ID number that you'd like to use for your Zap. Then, under Order Number, I'll click Order Number. Under Created Date, I'll click Created Date. Under Variant SKU, I'll click SKU. Under Quantity, I'll click Quantity. And under Price Per Unit, I'll select Price Per Unit. Last, select the tax rate ID you'd like to use for your Zap and click Continue. Click Test Action and I should be all set. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, anytime a new spreadsheet row is filled out, a sales order will automatically be generated in Katana. I hope this was a helpful demo. Zapier could do so much more with these two apps and thousands of others. Check Zapier out. There's a free trial. Click the link in the description.